Welcome back again to S level paper for information technology 9626 paper 2. We are already done doing spreadsheet paper and we're going to do now audio editing using Audacity. All the videos related with this AS paper for paper 2 are going to be found in one playlist. So let's carry on to audio editing. So open the file open the file which is called n24 audio mp3 in a so suitable audio editing package so i'm going to use audacity and change the speed of the track so that it is twice the original speed so we have opened it let's drag the voice into the audacity into the software what we need to do, we need to double the speed, so we need to make it faster. So you can see now it is up to 5. Um, you can see it's 4, it's like 4 seconds or 4 minutes and few seconds. Uh, you can see over here it's 4 minutes and 58, almost 5 minutes. We need to make it shorter, so it needs to be twice shorter or twice double speed. That means it is half of this length, it's supposed to be 2 point. Uh, 2.30 over here it's supposed to be around this much so let's highlight over it and then we can go to tracks uh, okay we can go to effect effects we have to look over here in pitch and tempo and we can click on change and pitch uh, change speed and pitch and we can make it into two uh, to be multiplied to two Okay, so we have to uh, make it to two. Let's apply it. As you can see, it become into two and a half seconds. Um, two and a half minutes. So that's it for this one. That's we're done with this. So change the pitch of the track from the key B into the key C hashtag slash DB. So to change it also, we need to highlight over it and then go back again to the same place pitch and tempo and we can click on change pitch over here it is already set to B we need to change it to CD actually this is this will not be set like that it will be just set up to whatever last time you change something um, so you need to set it into whatever recommended from the question paper whatever is asked so select select it and don't touch anything else on those numbers and leave it as it is and click into apply you will feel some changes happened over here so we're gone we're done with changing the pitch trim the next one is trim the length of the clip so that only the first 35 seconds remain so we need to trim it okay so we need only the first 35 seconds so overall this is uh two and a half seconds i just need the beginning so that's zero zero zero. I need it to be zero thirty five seconds. Okay, so I just need this part. Okay, actually I need it to be opposite. So I'm going to highlight it oppositely. So I just will make it thirty five to the overall. The overall is how much? Is twenty nine. So I just will set up here to be 35 okay and then I just can remove this part so I can just split it or I can just get it and remove it so I got as you can see just the 35 seconds the first 35 seconds okay then we're done so the next one is mix down the track so that the finished soundtrack is mono Phonic. so I just simply can go uh, okay I, we better go over here to tracks go to mix and um, you can choose it from here or okay just let's go over here to mix okay I just needed to select it all and then it's available over here mix down to mono one so just click on it and you can see just it become into one I just zoomed it okay for the next point 
we're done with mixing it and then set a two second fade out on the track so overall it is 35 you can just select the last two minutes so you can select uh, from 33 as you can see it's just selected the last two seconds and then you can go to effect fading and fade out so it just changed a bit over here uh, we're done with the fade out so now we need to export them into two versions or format the wave format and the ogg format and the name is supposed to be in a specific format so we better set it properly so n24 audio followed with your center number and candidate number so let's go over here export the audio export it to computer and export it by the way to the right location where all your work is there so select your wave format over here and export it as it is we selected make sure it is mono and then you can export it i think i put it okay i'm just going to export it one more time to make sure i just forgot to set it into the right location and i forgot to set it with the right name so it needs to be n24 audio followed with your center number whatever is your center number followed with your candidate number and then just select your right place i'm just going to copy this source and save it to export it to here as you can see we got it in the wave format the next one it's supposed to be exported in ogg format so again the same steps export to ogg and same browser to the right location with the right name so it's supposed to be with your center number and candidate number candidate number of course it will be just one given number to you during the exam time you need to remember what's your number or it will be just given to you and you need to write it down uh, correctly so we're done we got the two format and that's the end of the audio i will be doing the next question for the evidence of normalization see you in the next video